um, at Planet Fitness today. And, uh, you know, don't forget uh, to subscribe and click that notification bell. Um, also, um, you know, so I'm becoming a savage, you know. So who am I, uh, what, are we, what type of savagery are we into today? Well, we're here with Kyla, who's grinding out. Should I put you in this right now? Stop for a second. No, not sit yet. up, sit up, sit up, just sit up. Well, get off of that, sit up. All right, cool. I'm with Kyla today, and she's becoming a savage. <laughs> Say hi, Kyla. Hi. So today we're gonna show you cardio workouts. Uh, she's doing abs right now, so when we get to the cardio, we'll show you for great ways to burning fat. So uh, we'll show you when we get started with that. So uh, now that we're on cardio, we're gonna up up here. It's over here for her. That's. I'm not gonna do this. I'll do it right there. Okay. So she's over here. Ella. And this is great for cardio. We usually want to do, uh, we're going to do 250 steps today on five speeds. So put it on five, the plus button over there. No, over there, over there. Up to it says five. Good. Now, now you'll see the steps and that disappears. You'll see, so now four steps, five steps, and you're going to go all the way up to 250 steps. Huh? I was going to hurt. Well, you can go a faster speed if you want. Let's say good. But this is gonna work legs and it's gonna work abs. I always do cardio that's gonna do two things at once. So not just regular so I'll do something that's gonna do a leg workout and an ab workout because strong legs and strong cardio. Huh? 250. 250, that's right. Good. No, you're not. You're good. Good. You can go to speed and raise the speed. Good, now you're on eight. Whatever, whatever can get you to 250. You can't go slower. So whatever you could do, go to 250 without going slower. Good. So this is great for cardio. Boom. Good job. Good job. Nice. That's great cardio. Um, she's going, like I said, 250. And then how I usually do it is I uh, go up by either 15 or 25 steps. Uh, once I get all the way up to 500, then you go up, uh, up in speed. You go up speed three times. So you go up to six, then up to seven, then up to eight, and then you go up. So you switch on and off. So you do every hundred steps, you go up in speed. So when you go from 250 to 350, you go to six miles an hour. 350 to 450, seven miles an hour. 450 to five, so up to the point where you're doing at least a thousand. I stop at a thousand steps because uh, at that point, it's just like, you don't need to do any more than that unless you like, you know, training for a stepping competition. So I stop at a thousand steps. Uh, and I just keep going up the speed from there, just like with a mile. I run a mile, and then uh, after I get faster, you can run a mile. I just do the mile faster and faster because quick, fast cardio burns weight faster than long, slow cardio. So you always want to do fast, repetitive, rapid activities for cardio to burn faster, uh, more fat. So now we're going to do a jumping jack circuit. So we're going to do 10 jumping jacks here, and then she's going to jog down to that wall and back and 10 we're gonna do 100 of these right leg workout cardio workout fast cardio so jumping jack sprint down and back jumping jack sprint down and back uh it's good so we go up to 100 you can do whatever you want you can do sets of 20 we're gonna do five 10 sets of 10 do 10 sets of 20 whatever you want to do but this is just more energetic you ready just come over here say not in her way good run down Nice, nice, nice. Ten more. That's one. Nine more. Move over here. Jump up over here. Yeah. So that way they can walk there. Good. Down and back. Good job. Eight. Eight more. Good job. Keep going. So that's like our jumping jack workout. And if you wonder why I haven't worked out in a while, it's because I had a, I had a mini heart attack uh, earlier this month. Uh, just I got sick and uh, I was working out too much and working too much. And because I got sick, the, the cold spread to my heart and attack it. But at the end of this month, you guys will see me working out more, uh, showing you different lists. But for now, uh, we'll just do some basic stuff uh, that you'll see me and the clients training on. Uh, and then you'll see me getting back into it. So stay tuned, hold in there. 
just watch the other videos of the, and for the workouts, and then more workouts will be coming soon. Oh, Cal, how you feeling? Good. She's not feeling good. I'm beating her up a little bit. But okay. so now the, the fourth uh, cardio thing we're gonna do is on the treadmill. It's a basic one. I'll show you the more advanced one. You've probably seen it before. Um, so the basic one is just a wall. So if you're a beginner, this is just a wall uh, on an incline at high speed. You want to try to go for at least a half a mile. So. Now, you want to go at least to five, uh, depending on who you are, five and up, uh, is going to be slow. And then speed-wise, you can do something like uh, three, five, and you would do this until this says point five zero, oh, and you would just walk like that, right? And this is going to work uh, legs, like I said, as well as, um, you know, cardio as well. And, you know, what also helps out with cardio is abs. The better your abs are, the better you are at cardio. So, it's just a simple walk. Uh, I gotta get a better phone, it keeps getting blurry. It's just a simple walk like this, right? Jesus, this camera, my phone camera is There we go. So it's just a simple walk. Uh, obviously, go slower speed if necessary or faster speed. Uh, you can do this for 0.5. Uh, so that's another workout. And if you want to do a more advanced one, uh, we'll show you that one in a second. Uh, actually, I'll just show it to you right now. Um, and the reason, so. Um, and, and don't forget, like, you know, always ask me if you need the help with the workout, if how strong or weak you are, if you're beginning, and I have workouts for everybody. So I forgot who asked me about the cardio workouts, but this is uh, just showing you something you can relate to. So when you, when you uh, on, on the uh, YouTube video, you can, my YouTube channel, where, um, you can go on there and uh, check out the cardio one and always ask questions. Um, I'll try to get back to you as best as I can. I'm always pretty busy, but I'll try to show you more. So this is... The more advanced one, so I'm gonna slow it down now to a two, and we're gonna put it all the way up. You have more so yeah, so now what we're gonna do on this is we're gonna show you. So the first you want to do whatever you can do um, going backwards, which you want to do going forward. So hop off, and put your feet on the sides. Here, so I'm gonna show you. I'll show you first here. No, you can hold it. I'm, don't tell my doctor I'm not supposed to be doing this. So whatever you can do backwards, you want to do it going forward. Like this. Right? So this is a good distance. You can do it. So you want to start like forward first. I was trying to get you a little bit of time right here. So you see 15 seconds on. So every 15 seconds you switch. Oh, you can show me now. It's going to be a minute on. Are you seeing my body? My face? I can't see your whole body. No, not like fine. this. No, it's fine. Um, let me show my face right now. So you want to do a minute on, a minute off. So 15 seconds this way, and 15 seconds this side. Okay. 15 seconds this side, and then 15 seconds back. And then you're off for a minute. So on for a minute, off for a minute. So that's the uh, harder one. And now, Kyla's going to do hers. So go backwards first, twist around. Backwards. Yeah, make sure you can walk on this backwards. So keep your hands on the bars, and now start walking with your feet. Now let go. Let go of your hands. See, big steps, big steps. Pretty easy. I'm gonna speed it up until you tell me it's too fast. No, a little bit at a time. A little bit at a time. Good still? Good still? No, let your hands go, big steps. Bend your knees a little bit. So right there, so we'll stop at two. So she's gonna be at 2.1 and she's gonna do all the repetitions. I'll show you in a second. Go ahead, forward. That's right, and then side and side, back and back. Good job. Good. I got you. Five, four, three, two, switch. Good. 10 seconds left. Good job. Good, right? You don't also don't want your feet to crisscross. Five, four, three, two, switch backwards. Good. Good, good, good. Good, good. 10 seconds. Five, four, good job. Three, two, off, done.
Here, record me for a second. I want to show them. I got to show them something so they don't. Just get me. So what are you doing? The shot and stuff. Let's show my feet. Don't. Right? This is how you fall off the treadmill and you don't want the neck to go down. Don't let your feet too much close, right? Not like this. Show my feet. Right? Not like the first one, right? Show my feet again. Right? Don't do it like this. You're going with the hampers. You want to pump your arms kind of like you're walking. Just keep your arms feel as hard. Make sure you're pumping your arms when you're going with the hampers. So. That's really going to help you pump your arms when you're going back, like you're running forward. And make sure your feet don't crisscross when you're side shuffling. No, you, you got 30, you got 20 seconds left. Don't crisscross your feet or you will fall off. So, your feet don't touch, right? Like this, not like this. Cool down. You always want to do it at the heavy cardio. Lucky for us, the treadmills has it, have it already built in. Uh, so, you, you see it on the map, he does a cool down for you. Just press the cool down button. Now she's, no, it's, it's filling it. Oh. <laughs> so. She's at, I can press it. See, now she's at one, three, five incline. So automatically cool you down, it cools down for about two to three minutes. She pressed it twice, so it went up. But uh, that's your cool down. Um, um, yeah, it's a cool down. You want to do a cool down because your body's too, now it's too going too fast. You want to slow it down back to normal pace before you get off. Um, because you don't want to be overreacting. You don't want to pass out from doing too much work. You want to you know, equalize your body, equal yourself out again. Uh, and that's, uh, that's, um, you know, that's like uh, the gist for today for cardio. Uh, Tyler, how do you feel? How do you like it? So there you go. <laughs> and you just increase, right? When it becomes easy, you go up in speed a little bit more. Um, or if you're doing a jumping jacks, instead of doing 10 sets of 10, do 10 sets of 20. Uh, if you're doing a high incline, uh, you go up an incline a little bit more, go up in speed as it gets easier. Um, and then on a stepper, same thing. Uh, you go up in speed, usually every 100 steps I go up a mile an hour. So that's it for today. Um, you know, I'm, this is uh, the lifestyle of becoming a savage. Kyla's on her, on her journey of becoming a savage herself. Uh, we're all becoming savages. Uh, so don't forget to subscribe, uh, notification bell, and I will see you next time.